In this video, you'll learn how to enable GIS functionality in the map control. It supports Bing Search, Geocode, and Root services. I already have a project with our ribbon and the map control connected to Bing Map services. Let's add a new information layer to display data obtained from one of the GIS services. Open the Layer Collection Editor and add a new layer. We'll add the search functionality by setting the data provider property to Bing Search Data Provider. Specify the valid Bing key and bind the key stored in the Windows resources. Set the visibility property of the layer to the Bing Search button's checked state. We'll need this to show and hide layers later. Now, let's run the application. Notice that the search field appears at the top right corner of the map. Let's find the location of New York City. To show and hide the additional search results, click the drop down list button. To clear search results, click the clear button. Another approach to using the information layer is geocoding. Let's add this functionality to the application. Add another information layer to the map controls layers collection and set its data provider property to the Bing geocode data provider. Specify the provider's Bing key and set the visibility property of the layer to the Bing geocode button's check state. Let's run the application again. I'll use these buttons on the ribbon to switch visible information layers. Click the Bing Geocode button to switch to the geocoding. Let's try to get information about someplace near Washington. I click on the map and get the push pin pointing to the required location. The last way to use information layers is routing. Add the information layer object to the layers collection and set its data provider property to Bing root data provider. Specify the Bing key of the provider and set the visibility property of the layer to the Bing root button's check state. Let's switch to XAML. Set the name of the Bing root data provider to root provider to have an access to this provider from the code behind. Then handle the Windows loaded event. Open the code and call the root provider .calculate root method using the prepared previous list of root waypoint objects in the Windows loaded event handler. Run the application one last time and click the Bing Root button. You can see the built root through the specified waypoints. Note that all GIS providers can be used at the same time since they're stored in different layers of the map control. And that's it. Thanks for watching and thank you for choosing DevExpress.